Yo, what's up guys, Joey back with the video, mm, sorry for uh, not uploading continuously, so I have scheduled so many videos, but uh, I was not able to do that because I, I installed a new VST called Ozone 7 Advanced for mixing and mastering, mm, but uh, I didn't do it properly, I did not install it uh, the right way, so mm, I, was, uh, I, I was going to uninstall it, but unfortunately it took all my... Uh, VST is in that folder, in the folder that I have installed it. So I had to install everything from the beginning. It was a complete mess. Still, I'm not able to uh, install all the VSTs that I had before. But uh, I ins uh, I managed to install the VSTs that I used regularly. I have some of the generator VSTs like uh, Silent One and Nexus that I used regularly, and I have some of the FX plugin and uh, mixing and mastering plugins PSDs. So I thought of uh, making a tight beat of uh, Drake and Future Style. So I came up with an idea. So when I listen to uh, Drake's uh, beat, his producer will make a simple chord progression and he'll reverse it. So it, uh, it, it sounds nice. So I thought of using that trick in my beat. So uh, I come up with a uh, simple chord progression and I use that in my beat and I just simply reverse it. So I'll let you hear the beat once again, uh, once and I'll show you how I did that. So this is the beat, so it's not uh, finished yet, uh, I have to complete it. So before that, uh, uh, I thought it was cool, it would be cool if I show you how I made this. So we'll do this from the beginning. For this beat, uh, for this reverse effect, you don't need any XML plugins like Glitch 2 or what, whatever, like effect tricks or whatnot. You don't need any, any XML plugins like that, we'll do it uh, within the FL Studio within the FL Studio itself so I used uh, launch lizards uh, roads dark roads so I'll copy this code progression uh, if you want you can pause the video and copy this code progression for your beats mm, it's just, uh, simply uh, D sharp minor so I'll go ahead and click new I'll save this Let's add lizard launch. I use dark words one. It sounds like this. So let's reduce the volume a bit and let's paste the chord progression. So the tempo of the beat is 90 beats per minute. I've used uh, another uh, instance of uh, this lizard launch and I use, ah. I guess. This is it. Um, I use the same chord progression but I inverted it to the next octave. So it sounds fuller. So right now it sounds empty because we don't have that reverse effect. So what I'm going to do is let's um, I'm going to mute this and I'm going to insert Edison and I'm going to record this into Edison and just call, take this sample into the playlist and just I'm going to reverse that within the sample itself. So I'm going to show that right now. So let's set this to pattern mode. And let's go to Edison. Let's change this to now. I'm going to record 
and I'm going to start playing. So we'll stop it right there and let's go ahead and mark this point and cut, cut the silence at the initial stage and we play this and let's cut this also I'll take this right there. So if you see here, uh, there is something called reverse. So, so it will simply reverse it as it is. So uh, it will entirely reverse the song uh, right there. So I'll let you hear that. Uh, it will initially reverse it uh, from this side, like uh, from this chord to this chord. So. If you insert that into the playlist like this, sorry. Let's reverse this. So, uh, what you have to do is you have to cut everything from uh, on beat so i'll show that first uh, you can use this slice tool you can cut the chord progressions like that cut that right there just and this group them like this or you can do this uh, by so many means so if you do this like the, uh, like uh, what I'm doing right now um, you can mess up with the sounds like this you won't get so let's hear that You can send everything to the mixer channel and cut the lows if you want and add reverbs like so effects to make them cool. So it is really simple to make something like this. You can always do this with uh, any other sounds like uh, you can use some of the organs. So you can do this with organs or whatever. You can use any of the sounds or you can use any of the bad sounds and you can reverse this. It will uh, create a nice effect in your song. So glad. Uh, I hope it helps in any way uh, with your beat. So I'll make sure I'll post the video regularly. Uh, I will, uh, I'll keep up with my schedule. So if this video helped you in any way, smash the like button um, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't before. So I'll sign up with this video. It's Jovi signing off.
Peace.